Hello everybody, welcome to a uh, cool uh, chess combat live commentary video I want to make uh, Mortal Kombat Deception uh, older game that I actually really like playing. And it's just not a strategy video, it's a cool little video I don't think anyone's ever made. Where I just basically show you my opponent's uh, Mortal Kombat skills, so I'm just going to load my team and show you guys how I pwn. So, I haven't done any new videos um, gaming-wise in a while. Um, recently, I just uploaded um, some Cedar Point vlogs, a um, lot of other things such as, um, you know, Cedar Point vlogs, Cedar Point roller coasters such as Millennium Force, Magnum XL, 200 POVs, stuff like that. And I figured out I was just bored and I wanted to make a, um, just possibly a cool um, video on Mortal Kombat Deception since I haven't made any. Uh, videos on that and I've never seen anyone make a um, any type of live commentaries in this game besides LPs and I figure I just you know do a little cool chess combat video cuz you know whatever and yeah so right now um I am missing like three to two characters um such as Hitaru, um, Raiden and um I think Tanya or something I don't know if I ever do an LP on this game in the Deception Conquest, maybe I'll just I'll, re I'll just go over whatever. So right now I'm being Bar Baraka, and let me I talk I pwn with every basically all, every character. Like Baraka, I think I'm probably I don't think like I don't know I don't I can't really explain how good I am. I mean with Baraka I'm awesome. Scorpion I'm pretty sweet. Um, with also with um. With Sub Zero, I'm awesome. I'm awesome. With um, Liu Kang, I'm pretty awesome. And with Noob and Smoke, I'm okay. And with Shijink, I'm okay. But I'm only so limited with him because um, I don't exactly have his um special move set because I haven't beaten the whole conquest yet. But um, since I have two different profiles, um, you can have one profile with all the characters mainly. But your second your second profile though. Like, even if you don't have any characters, you still have your characters, though. So, it's kind of weird. And, yeah. So, yeah. It's a little confusing when I'm talking about, but, you know, whatever. Pwn Edge. I'm Tanya. That's, like, an awesome combo. I like that. Pwn Edge. I don't know, the Cory Blade doesn't have too many combos, really. It's just like, square left. That's, that's really it, really. Alright, Slick, we're like on a three win streak. No, wait, we're on a two, two win streak. What am I thinking? Um, yeah, so we're gonna have these guys, um... We're gonna have, um... Actually, it's not like a strategy video, it's just a little bit I wanna make. Um, we're gonna have, um, two rows of guys. Unless they use a, um any type of spells which causes us to die but when i played this game yesterday in chess combat i uh laid on a trap and i learned something to, um i wanted to take a little experiment like kind of like a little guess um if you go on a trap more than twice the same trap say if you put one guy on that trap and then you put the other guy on there well guess what the trap blows up more than one guy if you land on it so Okay, now I've since I've already showed you my Baraka and Sub Zero skill, let me show you my awesome um, Scorpion. I mean, my Scorpion skills. I think. Wait, did I say Sub Zero or whatever? Since I already showed you my Baraka and Sub Zero skills, I figured I'd show you my Scorpion skills since I'm pretty slick with them. Basically, in all the styles, I know all the major combos. So, except for this one, really, I don't really use that one. I'll show what the one I use. Like, I just pwn. I mean, it's just like... I don't know, what do you think? I think... I think it's smarter to have a character with specials, because... I mean... When you don't have characters with special abilities, like kind of like Trajinko, it's just kind of retarded. Oh, I don't got any of that combo. Three hit combo. And... I don't know, what should I use? Eh, let's use this kind. There we go. Yeah, I take the square for like the f third time. Mm -hmm. 
I, I mean, with Jinko, you gotta find the special moves, which is kind of cool. I only got, like, two of them, though, when I actually beat the game. I got, like, his... I'm pretty sure he has, like, a spear move. And the other one I got was a, um... Some weird Lee Mei kick thing, I don't know. Alright. Yeah, these people are stupid, but they're using all their guys already, which is kind of dumb. And since Sub-Zero is a shifter, as you saw, like, five minutes ago, or five seconds, whatever... I don't want to take a, yes, she's a shifter, but I don't want to take a chance, because I don't know exactly if I shift into her, and I'm, and I'm not very good with Tanya. No, not really. So let's pwn. Um, okay, I remember that one. Yeah, um, goodbye. Oh, screw you. Oh, I love that cha-cha move. It's like more like cha-cha-cha-cha. It's more like that kind of formation more than a, like, wah 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 whatever. Um, okay. Um, what's their move now? Um, let's move him, yeah. Because we're going to start, we're going to start taking over the first. We're going to start taking over the middle and the second row where the green health things are. So let's get that over with right now. Oh, sweet. Baraka's the grunt. Also, that means I can, um... That means I already turned to Baraka, which is good, because my one of my best characters is mainly Baraka. I don't know. I tried playing online. There's nobody ever online in this game, so it's not like I can really... It's not like I can really do any skills on here. Oh, uh, that would hurt. Getting need in the butt. Yeah, on this controller I'm using, it does have a little bad things about it. Such as it, um... It, it, um, like, uh, I, I can't finish my sentence. Um, such as the R1 button's not working, like it's like stuck and crap. Sometimes the thing moves by itself and the R2 button, you know, I don't even know how to explain the R2 buttons, it's weird. Like the cover's off and there's like this weird little pad thing you can push but it still works though, it's weird. And, like, the wiring, like, some dog, I think, to the controller up, so, like, the wiring's all weird and everything, but all the buttons work, so that's a good thing, except for the R1 thing. Well, so what it means, I can't really use it as a combination, like, anyone would with Pasha Jinko's, like, the Mantis thing and everything. Okay, time for you to die. Oh, interesting. Okay, now you're getting really mad. My gosh, that's like one of the favorite moves they use, I guess. Me, you're right in the stomach. St -st 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 stomach. And there's Ashra falling to her death. Wow. Um. Okay. Let's just start getting our guys over there so we can start poning and then end the match soon. Probably by the end of part two, part three, this video will probably be over, but let's just enjoy it. So, we're going to have guys as a front row with Dub Zero on the left corner, kind of health pad thing. And then our second row is going to be our um, backup with Liu Kang and um, Barack on uh, Sub Zero right there. So, we're going to fill. It's pretty soon we're going to start filling in, guys, so then we can um, get the show on the road. But for now, we're just gonna basically um, let them use their moves. And if they try escaping, we'll just use this Baraka to, uh, and kill this guy. Yeah, I, I don't really, I've only hit someone once with one of those traps before. And I, I don't know. They seem kind of useful. Sometimes they don't. This seems kind of dumb. Uh, more ponage with the Salat style. With a cool square, square, circle, sidekick combo. Goodbye. Oh, whoops. Aw, oh, screw you. Low demon, sweet. Dang it, that failed. How dare you. You know, I really just feel like killing you right now. Yeah. I like how, like, like if you go down once, let's say if you lose a round, then he, like, twitches right to his blades and, like, jumps out. That's kind of cool. I've been in this game with, like, five different characters. Um, let me name them. I've beaten this game with Baraka, Scorpion, Bo Raicho, which is very... No, 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 well, hold on, I did it wrong. I've beaten this game with Baraka, Sub-Zero, 
Liu Kang and um, Bo Raicho, which Bo Raicho is very easy to be beat Naraga with. Since you start out in the sumo style, then go to the um, that's a cool scorpion picture. Um, go to the um drunken drunken fist, and then just keep on pressing square. It's like you just you just pwn a lot. Believe me. Go on the ground. Go on the ground. Bye bye. Oh, that was easy. Wow, seven wins in a row. Now we got eight. Yeah, I mean, Onaga is kind of really annoying. Like, I, I almost beat him with Scorpion. Usually, when I beat the guys, I beat them with special moves, but Scorpion special moves don't really work that well on Onaga. So, what I, um, I feel like facing, I want to face him with Scorpion. I want to face him with Liu Kang. I'll face that Baraka right between those guys, but he's gonna Yeah, thank you. I wanna I wanna face you with Liu Kang. I haven't really been I haven't been him yet, I don't think. The thing about the sorcerers is they they can't move diagonal. Oh, he's going to the leader. Well, at least I can provide you guys with some uh Shijinko moves. I'm I'm kinda good with like his I'm mainly good with his mantis style, but the shell and fist I'm okay with. I, I don't know, it's just kind of weird. I mean, if I had, like, if this R1 bond would actually work, like, if it wasn't so stuck or whatever, I'm sure I could do better a little bit. But whatever. I killed him at least, whatever. And he really didn't even do any damage, I don't think, even. Yeah, but I want to face. Yeah, that sucks. Whatever. Well, let's just get Liu Kang in right position just in case, so. I'm putting right there. Yeah, I always wanted to play a cat and the mouse game where, like, you, like, everyone's dead and then, like, you surround the leader. I always wondered if someone actually did that before. Probably be kind of cool, actually, but whatever. And an awkward thing of Sindel being all fishy-fishy. I don't know if I got off subject or what. Probably did. I don't know. Alright, let's do some Hungar. I don't remember this one that much, though. Okay. Oh, that's kind of weird. He just shoves his nails in your eyeballs and shoves you on the ground. Whatever. Oh, I almost forgot. I'm okay with Ermac. I mean, he's okay. I don't know about him. The only way I really Ermac got brought up was because of that loading screen. That was, like, the only way because I forgot about the guy completely. Oh, cool, in prison. Yeah, I wasn't really planning to use him, because, I mean, I really didn't want to use him, and bro, how the heck did Baraka get over here? Let's take him back. Yeah, you know, I think, you know, I remember Baraka got, like, teleporter exchange or something, I don't remember. But let's start moving our guys a little bit ahead, so let's go after that Lee Maid chick, so then they don't have as much spell they can use. Yeah, so then they can't use that, uh, kill spell. Oh, a trap! Oh, come on! They did that exactly. Oh. Oh, there's my dead body. Well, um... Please don't say there's another trap right there, or else that's, imp or else that's not fair. Oh, I'm gonna lose this one, I know what. Well, that's a really good idea. What if you put a bunch of traps around your leader? How would someone lose? Well, I'm sure there's a way you can somehow lose. You know, I gotta look at these combos here. I hate freaking the conquest. Get to play like freaking so many different characters. It's ridiculous. As soon as you learn one character's movements, then you forget all the rest. Like, wow. Yeah, I'm so gonna lose. Yeah, I, I, I'm not very good with Astro, as you can tell. So, part one's over. I'll see you guys on part two.